best game of the season and kind of get that monkey off the back, so to speak, and put together a really good game? Well, definitely, uh, we're looking at game to prove ourselves and you know come out strong. Um, defense did our job and we stayed in our gaps and um, we wanted to prove the nation and to ourselves that um, we're the defense that we want to be. Was it important to do that before Stanford and show that? Uh, definitely, just for ourselves, honestly, it was, it was UCLA versus UCLA for us. So, um, definitely. What was different for you guys um, in terms of execution against BYU than it was the, the first two games? Uh, I feel like basically we were more we're more in depth into what we're supposed to do. You know, so um, we did our job. We, we previously went over what we did wrong in the previous, previous past weeks, and uh, you know we got to take care. Having Tack back, having Vet, have Enderdos back, and mm -hmm. Dion, how did that maybe work with the rotation, kind of keeping you guys fresh throughout the game? Too? Well, definitely, we, we always play a lot of D linemen. You know, I, th I believe we probably rotated nine guys. So, um, you know, keeping everybody fresh is a uh, big benefit for us. And you got some work inside, kind of right, going right. back to what you started yeah, doing yeah. here. Uh, yeah. How did that feel? That was a big week. Um, you know, a heavy run, heavy run team. Um, the quarterback's a runner. So we wanted to have our fast guys on the edge that game. Getting Tack back, it seems like he's a pretty big personality, both on and off the field. What does he bring now that he's back and healthy for you guys? Uh, a lot of energy. Um, you know Tack, he's crazy. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, you know, it's good to have him back. But, um, yeah, love having him back. Strong guy, fast guy, and uh, just a, a big benefit for our defense. Does he kind of set the tone? Is he a little bit of a tone setter for you guys on defense? <laughs> definitely, definitely. You can just tell by his attitude the way he plays. Um, you know, he brings energy, a lot of energy to the defense, which we all need more tired down now. So, What's going to be, I mean, obviously McCaffrey's going to be a big part of the game plan defensively. What, what do you think you guys have to do better than the teams that haven't been able to stop him? Just, I really just do our job, you know, believe in our coaches, have trust in our teammates, um, do what, what we always have been doing. So um, we're going to approach the same week that we approach every single week. Have you guys, you guys have already started watching the film on Stanford? Yes. Yeah. What's it like to watch McCaffrey do something? He's a great player. He's a, he's a really great player. Um, we respect him, and uh, we're going to do everything in our power to stop him and you know beat Stanford, not just McCaffrey. So. Is there one thing about Christian McCaffrey that makes him difficult, or is it just that he's so good at so many things uh, is what makes him so difficult? He's so good at so many things. He's a fast runner. Um, he, he has great eyes as a running back, uh, great eyes as a wide receiver, and uh, he's a respectable player, and so we're going to do everything we can to stop him.